Welcome to another Ron Johnson video vlogs and I'm shooting a video to talk about how you can live a better life today, how to do more introspection to yourself and you know, get the help you need out there because why not? Why not be more vulnerable about your needs and your wants and get them you need to need now? So today's video is about skills versus talents. I mean, how many of those out there wish they had a certain skill or a certain talent and well, how come I don't have it, but they do and I need to have it more or feel someone else is more intelligent than you? Well, let's let's take the difference. Talents is something you naturally have and are gifted with from birth, be it basketball player, football player, tennis, engineer, uh, anything that you naturally have a gift with that you can do easily that's require, that requires minimum effort. Skill is something that is learned. So a skill is something that you learn. As an example, two plus two equals four. It's a skill you learn and you practice. Driving is a skill you learn and you practice. Dating can also be a skill, learning and practice, right? Everything, these things are practice and that innate with the, in us already. So how to embrace it? Most of us think talents are something that we wish we had so we'll feel better. Oftentimes, we don't need that talent. Oftentimes, you can do it. I'm going to give you an example of a, of a talent that I have that I embrace. Or let me tell you the three steps to learning your talent. One, take an assessment. Two, ask friends around you that can articulate what you're good at. Three, self-inspection. What is something that you always lean on the most? Make a journal. Figure what's happening. That's a talent of mine I didn't know I had. Impulsive. Yeah, I am impulsive, and that's totally okay. Let me tell you why. So if I want to buy something new, I do my research, and I, I want it, I buy it right away. And sometimes I shouldn't, and I feel guilty. However, impulsive has to be an embrace. If I want to learn something, I'm impulsive, and I go research and learn about it. Starting school, I'm impulsive. I didn't do much research. I just kind of figured out what I wanted I went for. Learning something new, I'm impulsive. I go for it. When I, when I feel I don't have a change, I am post that goal for it. So if you notice here, it's a talent that I have, or maybe a behavior, depending on how you did, like to see it, but I can see how it can be, well, I buy stuff without uh, managing my money properly, it could be an avenue, or I now want to do something, I take massive action. That's, that's a talent of mine, I think. Massive action now. Skills, as an example, are built. What are my skills? Coaching is one skill that I've been working on for years. That's a skill. Skill is working with various people and learning more. That's a skill, right? Going to a new job to learn how to navigate a new job is a skill. You should embrace both. You should embrace your current talents and your current skills because you can use them for your advantage. Often we think because we don't have a certain talent or a certain skill that we won't be happy or we can't be creative or we can't get what we want. And oftentimes we overlook that talent. Embrace your own talents, embrace your own skills. Live the life that you want and use it for your advantage. Again, if you want to figure out your ta talents, take an assessment. Ask your friends what you're good at, what you're bad at. And additionally, inspect your life behaviors and what you tend to do. That's it. That's how you embrace your talents, and, or at least identify them and, and just be skills. So, thank you for listening to the Ron Johnson video vlogs, and hit that subscribe button. Let's talk, let's connect, and go to www.ronjohnsoncoaching.com and we can connect offline and in person. Thanks for listening.